So I'm with Jorge Herrera, and we are at ACE Adult Continuing Education, a program from Flagler. Today is October the 24th, and what's going on today? Uh, so today we're celebrating our third annual Adult and Continuing Education uh, program uh, celebration. It's the third annual celebration. And um, basically we are coming together as a community to celebrate the fact that uh, continuing education is important, lifelong learning, uh, corporate training and professional management, and test prep center. Uh, we, we just simply are bringing the community on campus. Students that live and work in this community are taking courses either for uh, lifelong learning, for personal enrichment, or to improve their skills in digital marketing, or or uh, some type of um, corporate requirement like Lean Six Sigma or project management. And it's, uh, it's a celebration of learning uh, and bringing the community on campus. That's and what we're doing. So I know people have short memories, but some of these courses are like, what kind of courses do people Well, think? okay, so in the professional, uh, uh, in, the, in the corporate training and professional development, those are, um, training courses for very specific skills people need to improve improve their careers. Uh, one of our new certifications is digital marketing science. Okay. Uh, so people that are already in digital marketing, they can take uh, this course, which is a semester long course. All right. Uh, almost 200 hours worth of training. Uh, they are taught online with a live online in a live online program. This is our third cohort that we have now. Our fourth cohort will start this spring, and people walk away with about six different uh, certifications, from Google Analytics to Facebook Sales. Uh, they learn about HubSpot. They learn about Marketo uh, platform. It is really enriching. So these are the kinds of programs that we're offering for our working professionals. Now today, the majority of our students are in the lifelong learning program, right. which these are the very inexpensive $49 courses. Wow. Some are more expensive because they are, are, are um, in more intensive courses or they require a lab, like uh, Materials and things like that. Things mm -hmm. like that. But they're very inexpensive, uh, six weeks, an hour and a half per meeting, from watercolor, or oil painting, belly dance, um, um, Putin and, and Russia, or any other literature course. Yeah, so ukulele group out there ukulele, too. Ukulele, guitar, Spanish, French, Italian. Uh, we have uh, about 30 courses coming up this, uh, this uh, fall B that starts October 29th. So it's a celebration of learning. It's a celebration so, of... So this something. is your third celebration here. Yes. Um, and so we would have to conclude that these are very popular and this ain't going anywhere. Uh, well, this is a commitment uh, by Frederick College to the community. Mm -hmm. This is part of uh, our service to the community, not only to the working professional, but to the everyday citizen who, is, who wants to uh, do something that maybe he or she has not had a chance to do before, like learn mm -hmm. guitar, right. or ukulele, or, or tango dancing, or tango, mm -hmm. ballet. Right. Uh, and yes, very popular and needed in the community because it's good to get out of the house and do something worthwhile, do something mm -hmm. interesting mm -hmm. and new. You yeah. gotta stretch your limits, right. you gotta challenge yourself. Mm -hmm. um, and that's what we're doing. We have registered, um, uh, we have over 3,000 active students wow. that take courses uh, every, every term. Oh wow. So I congratulate you on your third anniversary. Thank you very much for being here, always uh -huh. supporting our, our program. Okay. and. Uh, Hope the evening is just full of surprises. And remember, we are here at the historic Marlin House, built in 1839, mm. and is part of the registry of historic places in the country. And we're grateful to be here, and we welcome everybody to join the program. Just a beautiful place. Thank, Thank you, you, Jorge Herrera. Thank you. Thank you, and, and I just want to thank you all for being here as well. And I, I'm really, really proud of, of, of where we've gone with our adult and community education, and I really have to give Dr. Rera credit, Dr. Wolf Lacoos, uh brainstorm here. I have to be, uh, be, have to be honest with you, I was superintendent of schools in St. John's County when I heard that they were starting uh, community educa adult and community education at Flagler College. Well, I was not happy. 
because we had a, a community education in the school district and I was worried that uh, uh, they were gonna they, they were gonna put us out of business, which they have. Uh, <laughs> Jorge and I have uh, done quite a bit of scheming in uh, recent months and have plans that not even for, uh, President Joyner knows about. Uh, but he'll find out in due course. Uh, uh, but I, I you know I, I I can point to a number of examples. Uh, one being that uh, I hope soon we'll make some inroads into the uh, student center. Rumor has that we may have a dance floor over there soon. So uh, uh, we will uh, keep scheming and I will uh, keep you posted. But uh, thank you all for uh, participating and it's great to see all of you. First we have the uh, Susan, Dr. Susan Herrera's Spanish four class. They're going to perform. I'm going to move the podium aside. They're going to sing a song in Spanish and then the um, American Sign Language class by uh, Professor Ken Nichols is going to uh, perform a, a class, and soon after that, then we'll go outside for the ukulele, the uh, guitar, the tango, and the belly dance. So let's get started. Where's the Spanish group? Let's come up here. Two, one, two, three, four. Sunshine. You are my 